please don't forget to like this video and if you haven't done so already, click the subscribe button, then click the bell and then click all. Every like and subscribe helps us make more great videos for you. This guide shows you a way of installing those Windows 7 games like Solitaire, Hearts, Free Cell, Mahjong Titan, Minesweeper, Spider Solitaire, etc. on Windows 11. So all you need to do is open up Microsoft Edge or your preferred browser. I'm just going to do that. Now I've just installed Windows 11 on this computer so I might get a few things pop up on here if you do I'm just going to accept those and follow them through until I get to this page here or to Google or whatever page you've set as your uh, main page then what we need to do is we need to go up to the address bar at the top here not the search bar in the middle but the address bar right at the top of the screen click in there delete out anything that might be in there and then just type win7games.com that's win7games.com just like it's shown on the screen then press enter or return on your keyboard after a few seconds you'll get this page appear if you've spelt that correctly scroll down and keep going down until you get to this little green or blue download games here move your mouse over it left click once you'll then see up in the top right hand corner the win seven games for win 10 underscore a underscore 81 underscore v2 dot zip start to download this bit might take a bit of time it really depends on the speed of your internet connection but please be patient as it is quite a large file and there we go mine's nearly finished downloading just give it a few more seconds and there we go once you see open file there move your mouse over it left click on open file then once you see this windows 7 games for windows 10 there just move your mouse over it, click on the right mouse button and then move your mouse over open and click on the left mouse button and then move your mouse over extract all and click the left mouse button. OK, move your mouse over extract just there, click on the left mouse button again and then when we see that again, that Windows 7 games for Windows 10 and Windows 8, move your mouse over it, click the right mouse button again, go down to run as administrator and click on the left mouse button. Now it might look as though nothing's happening for a while, just be patient, but eventually the screen should darken and then it will say, do you want to allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? Well, as long as it says Windows 7 games for Windows 10, and Windows 8.exe there. It's okay to move your mouse over yes and left click once. Again, it might look as though nothing's happening for a while, but then after a while you should see please select a language. Once you see that, move your mouse over okay, left click once. And once again, it may look as though it's doing nothing, but please just be patient with it. Something will happen in a few moments. Well, there we go. I just had to pause that video for about a minute before anything came up. So once this screen comes up, move your mouse over next, left click once. OK, now there's a few games in here that won't work for definite and they're the Internet games. So move your mouse over the box just to the left of Internet games, left click once just to untick internet games and internet backgammon internet checkers and internet spades because unfortunately they do require the microsoft server to be active and that was closed down a while ago so those games won't work the rest of the games will work and if you want you can tick or untick the games that you want and what you don't want so make sure there's a tick to the left of the games you do want and no tick to the left of the games you don't want once you've chosen then move your mouse over install, left click once. It will now start to install. Now again, this bit might take a bit of time, just be patient. Then once you get to this screen here, move your mouse over the little tick just to the left of Discover WinAero Tweaker to tune up Windows 10 slash 8.1 slash 8. Just left click once to take the tick out of it. Move your mouse over finish, and again, left click once. Then what we need to do is we need to move our mouse over the cross just up there, left click once and then what we need to do is we need to move our mouse over this cross here again left click once and then we move our mouse over the cross to the on the right hand side of edge again left click once and then what we can do is we can just tidy up the files there now so click on the little yellow folder at the bottom of the screen there 
Then once this window appears, go into downloads, doesn't matter whether it's the one up here or the one there, just go into it. Okay, and if you see anything that says win seven games for win 10 underscore eight underscore 8.1 underscore V2, you can delete it. So, so left click on the first one and then click on the bin just at the top of the screen there and that'll get rid of that. And there should be a second one there with a little zip through the yellow folder. Click on that once and then click on the bin just there to get rid of that. And then if you wanna find the games, all you do is just click on the start button just there and then just type the name of the game that you're searching for. So I've, I've clicked on, I've typed Solitaire and under best match, there you go, it says Solitaire. So I'm just gonna click on that and hopefully there you go, Solitaire will open. If I wanna search for another game, just click on again on the little start button and then just start to type the name of the game. So say if it was Mahjong, so there you go. I've started to type Mahjong. It's appeared under best match, left click once and there you go. It loads. So there you go, that guide showed you how to download and install the Windows 7 games in Windows 11. And if you do find after an update these games have been removed, then just follow this guide again and hopefully they should just reinstall. Hope this guide helps and don't forget to check out my other videos. Thanks for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at CWTech. That's at CWTech on Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel. Just Google Chris Waite YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.